Hello everyone. Welcome to this video lesson. In this video lesson, we are solving a problem basing on a topic reflection of the light on a curved surface or a mirror and this is from ray optics. Let us identify the problem first. The position of an object u from the mirror and the position of the image v is given to us from a spherical mirror. If an object is moving towards the mirror with a velocity v o, what is the velocity of its image is? That's what our question is. So let us consider the mirror first. This is a mirror. You can consider a convex or a concave mirror. It doesn't make any difference. Any spherical mirror is fine. Then, this is the principal axis. Let us assume this is an object here. This is the corresponding image. So, it is obvious that this is called object distance u. This is called image distance v. Assuming that this mirror is having a focal length f, as per the mirror formula, we know. As per the mirror formula, the general mirror formula, 1 by v plus 1 by u equal to 1 by f. Now it is given in the problem that this object is moving towards the mirror with a velocity v o. The image also moves towards the mirror with a velocity v i. I have to calculate what is that v i is. Being u v are the positions, u is nothing but position, v is also a position, that's nothing but a displacement, and we need velocity. So we shall differentiate the above equation with respect to time so that if I differentiate displacements or positions with respect to time, I'll get velocities with respect to time d by dt of 1 by v d by dt of 1 by u d by dt of 1 by f that's what our equation is simplifying that further we know there is a formula differentiation of x power n equal to n into x power n minus 1 then differentiation of 1 by v that's equal to differentiation of v power minus 1 equal to minus 1 into v power minus 1 and minus 1. That's nothing but equal to minus 1 by v power plus 2 because it is nothing but equal to v power minus 2 there. So that's nothing but equal to 1 by minus 1 by v square. Applying this rule there from this equation number 1. Differentiation of 1 by v is minus 1 by v square. As for the chain rule of a differentiation, I have to write dv by dt because this v also varies with respect to that of a time. So I have to write dv by dt. Similarly, differentiation of 1 by u is minus 1 by u square. And as per the chain rule, du by dt d by dt of f equal to 0 because focal length of a mirror doesn't vary with respect to that of a time. That implies minus 1 by v square. Change in the position of the image with respect to time is vi minus 1 by u square. Change in the position of the object with respect to time is vo equal to 0. So simplifying this minus 
vi i by v square equal to it implies v i equal to minus v by u whole square and v naught is the equation for the velocity of the image when the velocity of the object is known for us thank you for watching keep coming back for more and more video lessons thank you